Talk to Sarge. This is a good opening. Turn one, double two drop. Can probably replace... We can replace at least one of these. Possibly both. Uh, trying to find... Card draw. Egg morph's not bad. Um, I guess... Oh, Wolby's pretty good against artifacts. Maybe we ship this. Because most of our minions probably don't die to it. No, we, we need this for early interaction. Let's do this and look for card draw. Sweet. Alright. Am I running more in Curry on my list? I was. I cut one to fit card draw in. I'm playing Blazehound as a fake version of my spoiler card. And good evening to you too. Sarge's sword is the one that spawns totems. Oh yeah. Spine cleaver. It is on this version, but like Mark II Sarge has Thunderclap and a fire sword. Let's take sure. I don't have Morinko on mind lathe, so many legendaries to craft, and I'm trying to save for the expansion. I if it helps, I don't think Morinko is necessary. Um the card is cool, but not that good. Uh, healing Mystic. Probably means like burn Sarge. So this will be less useful. It won't be obelisks. There might be Amara healers later, but mostly we want pressure. Cute. <laughs> we can reactivate our young Silithar. I don't think that's Cold Biter. With all the Wild Frost on it, it looks like it's going to have stun synergy if it's added. Yeah, I agree. It's probably some kind of spell staff thing. Zeron wears Dawn's Eye on one of the portraits. Huh. Is it meant to be... Is Dawn's Eye like a suit of armor? Or something? Like, from what I remember of the art, it's like a big shield or breastplate or something with a lion's face on. Oh, yes. This is what happens when you try and tempo vet in the early game. Okay. Um, well, I can play some stuff. I guess I can kill this. Um, and heal. Oh, that's awkward. Oh, I can use this monotile. I'm not even going to bother healing the Primus Fist, I think. Because, um... Vet tend to be aggressive, and Sarge has Psionic Strike Up. <clears throat> but I will try and protect this from it. Sweet. Falkius wins versus pretty much everything other than turn one sun still. Yeah. Silly Falkius. It's a helmet. Oh, okay. It looks really big for some reason. There's like a weight to it in the picture. I know it's a tiny little icon, but still. Oh. Do excuse me. Rather heal yourself since he's going to Falkius the 2 3 anyway, especially if there's additional value on it. Yeah. Oh my. Well, I mean, this is fine. We can clear now. Now we don't even have to use the Lava Lance. Although I can if I want to save on damage. Uh, I need card draw. That is not card draw.
I'm really tempted to just get in for 10 and hope we top deck some draw. Like, we still get a bunch of pressure off this. Can we just attack with it once? Nah, screw it. Yes. <laughs> for what is. Um, I Like, I think definitely losing life in this game is pressure. You have to play differently when you're on low life. Like, you have to respect burst. You know, I could do that again, right? Next turn. Or maybe the turn after. My opponent has to play around that. Like, why Why would I do that, right? Why, why am I playing so aggressively all of a sudden? Wings of Paradise. Scary. How much damage do we have? 8, 9, 10. Uh, if I replace, I can try and hit Mechanto Warbeast. Doesn't kill my opponent necessarily, but it gets close. But if I replace this, I lose on being able to play it this turn. So I think I'm going to sacrifice the ability to Warbeast. Huh, <laughs> sick. Um, yeah, go on. Can I afford to attack? So we got a fifteen, ten. And it's seven, six, five, three from Falcius or Blood of Air. Or like second wish. You know, we have enough pressure on board that I think I'll pass. Oh, sick. Oh, that'd be good. I'd have another three, three frenzy thing in hand. Only reason I can see for throwing it away. It might have just been because. That's where they wanted to put their stuff, like. Um, I see an enemy combo and they just have, they have two cards in hand. I'm just going to assume they're looking to top deck lethal. Yeah, exactly. So now she has to play on the defensive, if that's the assumption. Zephyr of the Century. Yeah, I guess. That would suck. There's the second wish. There's the first wish. <clears throat> so she's like five off lethal. And if she doesn't have Falcus, we've won this game. Actually, even if she does and she doesn't have a ping, we've still won this game. Nope, that body box. We're not talking about it. Okay, we need Lava Lance. Um, Wild Inceptor doesn't quite do it. Oh no, Wild Inceptor does it with this. That does not do it. Um, that's probably enough to lose us the game. It's a pretty good body block. So I can buff this and kill the... Skywing, but I think I'd rather punch this with my face. Um, kill this with the Rage Binder and spam out some dudes. Uh, including a, an egg. If we do this, this. This, healing the Mystic. This, but that, whatever. This, go. Where were you last time? <laughs> so 
Sans smokes wish. Oh yeah. <laughs> Second wish is so brutal. So nice to see Gazer on Ladder. I used him in the very first deck I made. So I made my budget aggro magma. Nice. Good nostalgia. I used to play them as well. Like turn one Phalanx, I'll turn two Gazer, right? Yeah. That was that was the jam. Before uh, people learned that Blood Tear Alchemist was a card. And then you were very sad. Okay, I think I've got like maybe a couple more games left in me after this and then I'm gonna have to give it a rest for the evening. <coughs> this is fun though. This game is sweet. Ow. Oh, okay. <laughs> ah, she drew a Zephyr. And she's dead. Victory. To be fair, I'm not sure why she conceded, because I didn't have lethal on board. It had to be out of hand. Still, though. 